Welcome to this week's video. I'm Rick the Science Guy and today I'm going to be talking about alfalfa. Uh, I have some alfalfa here standing out in an uh, alfalfa field. There were just a bunch of cows on here earlier today. They moved them off. But I wanted to talk to you about the health benefits of alfalfa, why I'm selecting this um, as something that's a critical part of my diet. So interesting thing about alfalfa um, and I want to draw your attention. I have a little plant here and um, show you these little nodules here. Um, I don't know whether you can see these little white nodules. These are actually uh, what are called uh, a symbiosis effect, which means one thing that benefits from another. So there are bacteria that live in these little nodules of the alfalfa plant that actually fix nitrogen. And what that means is that they take nitrogen out of the air and then um, transport it into a food source that the plant can actually use because the plant cannot consume nitrogen on its own. So it needs the bacteria growing in the root nodule itself, <laughs> there's my dog, uh, to uh, help fix that nitrogen into a, sort, uh, a means that it can use. So anyway, that's one benefit of alfalfa. Also is has a very, very deep uh, root system and I'll show you that here in a second. Um, been used for thousands of years for different herbal remedies, uh, Chinese herbal remedies especially, digestive issues, kidney issues, that kind of thing. So lots of health benefits to alfalfa as well. Now getting back to that root system, um, alfalfa has an extremely deep root system, much deeper than most other plants. And so just to illustrate that, I wanted to show you this. This board is 16 feet tall, okay? So this is about the average depth of an alfalfa plant, 16 to 20 feet. So you can see that they, this plant has the ability to go way down deep in the soil, way beyond our, our modern um, agricultural practices and where our modern farming has occurred to get those nutrients and those micronutrients up out of the soil. That helps uh, from the standpoint of allowing those micronutrients to uh, help with enzymes, our enzyme function, help our bodies run much more efficiently. So that's why I choose to have alfalfa as one of the things that I put into my diet every single day, um, alfalfa juice, uh, to have all those different health benefits. So that's this week's video. I'm Rick the Science Guy. Now get out there and have fun. Thanks for watching.